Okay, y'all. We're going to get a reading here. And Father God, please let the energy move. Let something better come out this time. Because we are tired of seeing negative updates. I'm gay, no one knows, but the man I sleep with. Oh, Lord. I want to have sex with you. I have someone else, but I want it for one night. Their money, hunger, greedy, deceptive, no love, a taker. Someone has a crush on you, it's a Scorpio. Okay, this energy I don't want to deal with. I know I usually be hitting notes on Cormac. Situations, but I'm really not with it. And if this man is gay and no one knows, this man could be on fire. <laughs> this is all I'm telling you. I just seen the fire truck. That was a sign, whoever this is, could be on fire. Mm. Whoever it is is trying to come up with a resolution and they're just trying to get to their happy space. I'm gay, no one knows, but being I sleep with. This person is trying to come up with a resolution, six of swords, and seeing the light about, hey, you know, in order for me to be happy, the person that I'm dealing with be happy, I got to come clean with this situation. I got to come clean with what I'm going through, what I'm doing, what's happening with me. I have to come clean. Yes, because whoever this person is, they see you as home. The they they are aware. This could be a water sign, an earth sign, or a fire sign. An air sign is involved, and an earth sign. This person is uncertain that you would want to be in a home connection with them, but this person is passionately ready to put in the work due to this journey. I want to have sex with you. I have someone else, but I want it for one night. This fell out on this, and what I'm getting is this person, Queen of Pentacles, want, he want to have sex with you, but in the back of his mind, really, or her mind, she's saying, I just feel it. This is the person that I'm supposed to be with. I know this, this is the person I can work with, that I can gain Pentacles with that I could have a home life with. This person would make me more abundant in my spirit. And, you know, I could move forward in the journey in order to be happy or whatever. Um, this person sees you as single, working on yourself, uncertain about the journey at times yourself abundant and home they sees you see you as their home whoever this is but they're gay i don't understand they want to be happy they want to come up with a resolution i'm getting that this is a total person someone is trying to gain the strength their money hungry greedy deceptive no love a taker Someone is coming in their power trying to gain the strength to tell you what I'm getting this card from. This first card is in your energy and God is trying to tell you about someone that is close to you. And something about some money in life 
got something to do with this or whatever but because at the I never did, did realize this they got the airlines here in the paper but at the very top they got content tent titles up there with just a word and content words that's just one word up there and at one on one corner it says money then the other one it's life or whatever this money and life situation here or someone is just saying that they want to have their money and live their life this is gonna be a family member. This, this core, this card right here. Um, gay, no one knows but the man I sleep with. This person just wanna be happy. This person could have left, left town. This could be a family member left town running, running from you because they didn't want you to know. Uh, this stuff's going on with the I want sex with you only for one night. They see you as home. They're uncertain that you would accept the offer for them to go on this journey with you. They feel that they would be abundant, home. They're passionate. This person could have been a player in the past or, or a person that was on the journey to just like have sex with people but they're coming to cahoots that they're getting older they don't want to do this they see you as single getting comfortable in your pinnacles the queen of pinnacles i want to have sex with you Someone is their money hungry, deceptive. They're trying to get strength enough or whatever to go off on their own. They're trying to gain strength to heal themselves or to change how they are. Someone is trying to find their emotions, their heart being closed off, angel of peace. And they got a crush on you and they want to come to a new peace for you or whatever. You could have been with someone that was money hungry, greedy, deceptive, a taker, no love, a taker. They didn't have any love. Their heart is closed off. They don't care to love anyone. They do things for out of surface reasons. Let's put this up. This. I want to see with you a taker in the crush. You need to be aware of someone that's around you that could be pretending to be a friend that just want to use you for something. They they don't really have any love for you. They don't care what's going on in your affairs or care how you're living or what you have. It's all about them. They're selfish. It's about them, not about you. Type energy. Someone in your family, I believe, want to tell you that they're gay. They just want to get money and live their life. Is I'm stuck. Hate and envy. Karmic cycle ending. Awesome. We need this to end because all of this, because I feel, you know, and by this being Gay Pride Month, someone is just saying, I don't know if it's to do with Gay Pride or what. I just want to get live, get money and live my life and be gay if I want to be. So I'm going to leave from around you so, I, so you don't have to be around me and I don't have to be around you and I can just go live gay if I want to. any judgment is what I'm getting. Someone is filling up their cup. They want to give you support. I'm stuck. They're trying to find their emotions. They're, they want this to be peaceful. If they leave, 
Six of Cups, support. They want to give bring justice to not supporting you in the past. And this could be over the internet or something. Someone could be stalking you, watching you. Um, this could be a water sign. Want to bring justice, an uh, air sign to do with the air sign. And uh, someone's kind of flighty, usually be talking trash or whatever. They're young. They, they're gossiping about you. They want to, they want to, uh, betray you, but they can't because someone about your support, they didn't want you to get support. This person is stuck. They need to heal. Justice is going to be brought with whoever this is. This, this could be a water sign or a Libra or an air sign that's involved with this. Someone's filling up their cup of emotions. They know what it is. Yeah, uh, hated envy, hated envy, ten of swords ending, independently going on your own, and eight of pentacles. You're guarded. You're speaking your truth. You're sick of hate and envy. You know, you could be telling them, no, bitch, I don't want to work with you. I don't want you working with me. I don't want you taking my shit. I don't want you doing anything pertaining to that. I just want you to go on. You treated me unfair. You treated me unequal in the past. And I don't want to do anything of that nature. I just want to go live my life and get money. Because the karmic cycle is in that someone is guarded and they're speaking their truth and they're raising Cain, they're raising hell. Yeah, karmic so five of swords lost. Whoever left you out in the cold and wanted you in the cold and wanted you stuck and all of this, that, that kind of cycle is ending. It's going to be them. They're going to figure out that they lost this game that they were playing and that you're going to end up in a partnership. You're the angel of blessing that you come with wisdom and knowledge. No college or going to college or something of that nature, they're gonna find out that they couldn't hurt you, whatever, but they was trying to keep you stuck out of hate and envy and the public cycle of envy not gonna be able to do that anymore. They're gonna feel lost. Yeah, the tower is coming. The tower is coming, they're gonna feel lost. No one uh, this first note, I just wanna be gay, get money, and live my life. That's what someone is saying. Oh, a karmic cycle. Because it's been indifferent for this person all their life in their love life. They're starting to realize it's their childhood wounds that have kept, kept them stuck. Someone's going to communicate this. Someone's going to be successful, they're gaining their strength, they've been generous to people due to their creativity, they've been manifesting and juggling work and money, they're going to have a new beginning and a victory, and they're coming up with the resolution right now, whatever, this could be a friend, a page of cups that wants to come towards you, or whatever, they could be stalking you and watching you. You may bump into this person in your community or somewhere or even on the internet. You may see this person on the internet or something. And then you try to be in envy and jealousy. That's ending. It could be due to a friendship as well. Someone you met on the internet is a friend or pretended to be a friend. The tower is coming. I manipulated, cheated. The world is going to end in Ten of Swords to Cormix that's trying to put out Cormix to make you question your, your spiritual. You're going to have choices. It's a lot of people you're dealing with. Choices of people to work with. Or choices of things to do. Regarding your career or your business or something of that nature. The secret is what? What is the secret? The 
it is the secret they hate and lying and stealing and cheating. But is the, the secret is you have been a blessing to us. You have been a blessing. Oh my God. The secret is you are the star. You have brought in hope to people. People really love you, Nine of Cups. You're um, you're giving out emotions and love to everyone due to your creativity, passionately, being of words, whatever uh, you are, the star, angel of hope, you're a blessing to this community. If they don't see it, then they're crazy. You have helped gain hope, all of that. And you're making progress moving forward. You're a leader. Be a teacher of some kind, a spiritual healer. Could be a songwriter, a writer, a poet. You have been a blessing and an inspiration to this community. Don't let the Cormans tell you that you're not going to be stuck anymore. You're going to move out the way. Move, bitch. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Move. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. That's what someone is saying. Move. Get out of my way. Like, stop trying to control me or whatever and keep me down and stuck because you don't want to see me prosper. But I'm out here giving hope. I'm the dope you want to smoke. But I'm out here giving hope. I'm the dope you want to smoke. And you never threw the rope. And you never threw the rope. Y'all will never throw the rope. Y'all will never throw the rope. But I'm after giving hope. I'm the one. I'm the dope you want to smoke. But you claim you really go. But you claim you really go. No, no, you ain't giving hope. You wouldn't even throw the rope. I was down here, I couldn't cope. I was down here, I couldn't cope. And I stay up on my moat. And I stay up on my moat. But I'm out here giving hope. I'm that dope you want to smoke. But you hoes me claiming goat. But you hoes me claiming goat. That y'all really come with smoke. That y'all really come with smoke. But I'm out here giving hope. I'm the dope you want to smoke. Dope you want to smoke. I went down the wrong slope. I went down the wrong slope. Y'all would never throw the rope. Y'all would never throw the rope. I was down here, couldn't cope. I was down here, couldn't cope. Four of Pentacles, control, less than nine of cups, fell out again. You about to be blessed. You gonna take control over your finances because people was trying to keep you stuck. They wasn't, didn't want you to have no hope. They didn't want to help you. They wanted you not to be able to cope. And they would never throw the rope. Whatever, well, God coming to bless you. Nine of Cups, you got emotions for people. You've been helping people with your creativity for, for nothing. People been stomping all on you, trying to make you seem like you're not doing this and you're not doing that. Whatever. Yeah, you got some good stuff coming in, Collective. Vision release. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Relief from distress. The Lord upholds all who fall and lifts up all who are bowed down. Psalms 145, 14. And we know what God cause, causes all things to work together for good to, to those who love God, to those who are called according to his purpose. Romans 8, 28. Provision. Bring the whole tithe into the storehouse that there may be food in my house. Test me in this, says the Lord Almighty, and see if I will not throw open a floodgates of heaven and pour out so much blessings that there will not be room enough to store it. Malachi 3.10. Whoa, that was just giving us a... a, 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 a confirmation collective you're about to be blessed like whoever been on this journey and been doing the work and you have been good to people and you didn't mean no harm and you was just being led and guided by God by spirit 
Nine of Cups blessing. You got a bunch of blessings coming in. Could be about nine of them. Your finances is about to be t taken control of by the blessings. Four of Pentacles. These karmics or whoever these people is that wanted to stop, block you, and not let you get. God is about to do something in your life, and I do not know what it is, but your finances is about to get control taken over. The storehouse, floodgates of heaven, let it rain, let it rain. Open the floodgates of heaven, let it rain, let it rain. Okay, collective, that's what I got for you. Like, if someone was trying to stop your finances, take them, keep you from getting them, they didn't do nothing but bless you, collective. That's what I'm getting. So you just wait for it. It's coming, baby. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. God bless.